really what this is about is the passion of creation. This is what's called Kidney Modern, but the book is kind of a trinity of ideas. Uh, one is most importantly as we celebrate uh, these mid-century heroes through little, little poems and prose and designs that reflect uh, their point of view. One of the things I'm always inspired about so many artists from, from that, that excelled in the mid-century is that they were so interested in sharing their ideas with young folks. And I was a, a, a little boy and I wanted to know what kind of paintbrush to use. And I wanted to know what gouache was. And, you know, I've always felt a little bit like Margaret Mead as I've gone through my life and looked at things more like an anthropological point of view. And, if you look at things like that, pretty much everything's fascinating. Even the dullest of materials. I mean, if you don't even care about what you're looking at, at least look at the way that the, the text is sitting on the page. Because there's something to learn about all of it. The tooth of the paper. I mean, just look, look at the book sideways. Look at the old end papers. Look at the old, you know, the, the reinforcements. There's something you can learn from every book, whether it's from its physicality or from the actual words. Oh, wow. Yes. I thought you liked that. Okay, Golden Books is maybe one of our, I think, our national treasure <laughs> publishers. And one of the real treats about these is that they're luridly colored. I mean, look at the beautiful, elegant font. We can learn mm -hmm. so much from that. And besides the actual typeface itself, you can learn so much about the way it's placed, the, the negative space. I mean, this is, this is a very elegant idea. You, you rarely see negative space in modern design. Well, I think that the time is the only thing that disconnects us because the <laughs> spirit of of this, the urge and the joy of making things is with us today as it is 100 years ago and 1,000 years ago. It's just in our DNA. So how nice that uh, in modern times we have so many support systems to help get that out. Before we started the book, we came here, did our research, and fine-tuned uh, some of our ideas, and we, we, we couldn't have done it as easily if we hadn't had the New York Public Library to come to. I'm so glad that we had stuff to inspire you. Indeed. I think it would be impossible for anyone not to be inspired <laughs> in this place.